squad, how are you doing? I'm super excited to see you here. I'm so happy that you're joining us for this very important mission. It's very important superpower. And we should be practicing it all year round, but this month is when we're gonna really dig deep into this superpower. Does anybody know what superpower we're gonna be unlocking this month? I'll give you a clue. We're launching this mission in the month of November that for many people in the U.S. has a very special day called Thanksgiving. And on Thanksgiving, we practice this superpower of gratitude. This is not only a very important superpower, but it's one of my very favorite superpowers because Gratitude has played such a big role in my life because my grandma always was talking about it. She was always talking about gratitude. And it wasn't until I was way older that I really understood why it was so important to her. And so what I'm hoping is that for you, for our tiny superhero squad, you can learn it way earlier than I did because this really is a superpower, okay? So the patch we're going to earn for unlocking our superpower of gratitude is this. It's a gratitude journal. And what do you think we're gonna be making this month? We're going to make our very own gratitude journals. And if you look at the patch, you might be like, that's not how you spell grateful. There's a number eight in the middle, but it's kind of just a play on because it's like we're grateful. Isn't that funny that the number eight Sounds like the letters A-T-E. Anyway, I hope you like the patch. I can't wait to dive into this mission with you. This is really, really important. And I think it's going to be very fulfilling. And we would love your family to rally around you to do this too. Because the superpower of gratitude isn't just for tiny superheroes. It's for every human. So dive in with us. I'm going to tell you all about the mission. Our goal for this mission is to keep a gratitude journal. Now, sometimes the word journal sounds a little daunting for people, but grown-ups don't panic. This is going to be a very fun, easily adapted mission, and we're excited to see how it fits your family best. So the first step is that we have a template for you. Maggie designed this amazing journal, and you'll click on the button and download it so you can print it. If you don't have a printer or if you like making your own, feel free to design your very own gratitude journal. This is designed to help you if you want it, but that is not how you complete the mission. You're going to complete the mission by practicing gratitude. So whether you do it with this journal or your own, it doesn't matter. So you're going to print it out. Um, Grownups, I made mine like this size. You can make it big or small. Um, when I printed it, I just said to print four pages on a page, which is like a print one of the settings when you push print from a computer, and it came out perfectly. So um, feel free to, again, do this however you want, but in the first step, we have the template for you. The second step is that every day, we're going to draw or write one thing we're grateful for. Now, this can be hard and it can be easy all at the same time. The thing about doing something daily is that we have to make it a habit. And what I like to remember is that if I miss a day, it's okay, right? But I'm gonna do the best I can to do my gratitude journal every day with you because the benefits of practicing our superpower of gratitude only become bigger and bigger the more we practice it. So I'm gonna give you some examples. We're going to color mine in too. So on November 1, I was grateful for, this is, this is fun. This is my mom and you see patches and this is my mom's friends and they come in and they help us with tiny superheroes every single week. They volunteer and we are so grateful for them. And so they got the first spot in my journal because they were here that day and I was just so grateful to have them here. So you can see for this one, I actually printed off a picture and taped it in for my next day. Oh, this was a good one. Rory had a soccer game 
and it is, it's supposed to be winter here and it's like 70 degrees. So I was so grateful that the weather was so nice for Rory's soccer game. The next day, oh, I don't know about you guys, but fall leaves are just my favorite. And I find myself driving around and I have to stop my car and take pictures of them because they're so gorgeous. So on this one, I have a picture of a fall leaf because I think the colors are so beautiful. My next day, this was November 4th, I was grateful for my family. So I just drew a little picture of us. We've got me and Joe and Sheldon and Milo, or maybe that's Rory, and Milo and Patches. So with the gratitude journal, you can write, you can draw, you can put stickers, you can put a picture, you can do whatever you want. And for our grown-ups who are like, my tiny superhero is a little bitty, or my tiny superhero doesn't write with a pen, or my tiny superhero doesn't talk with words that I can understand. Listen, gratitude is something that we feel together. So this can actually become such a unique keepsake for your family. Maybe you keep one together as a family. And whether you're writing it or your tiny superhero is writing it, or you're drawing it or your tiny superhero is drawing it, the conversation around expressing gratitude is what matters. So this little book can be such an amazing thing to keep forever in your tiny superhero's toolbox, and it can really capture a full month of your life. Maybe you'll love it so much you'll even keep going. So that's the step two, is we're going to write or draw one thing you're grateful for. And the third step is we're going to repeat it every day. Again, we should be really graceful with ourselves because doing something every day can be really hard. But I'm going to do it with you and we're going to commit to it because gratitude, the effects of gratitude practicing daily are enormous. And I'm going to tell you all about it here in a minute. After you do this, we want you to share. When you post a picture or a video in the Facebook group, you encourage the squad members to do the mission with you. And you are bringing awareness, not only to tiny superheroes, but to gratitude. And imagine a world where people started their day with gratitude. If you've ever had like a bad day, Something I try to practice, and I'm always getting better, right? We can always get better, so I'm not perfect at it. But if I'm having a bad day, and I have all these feelings going on in my chest and in my head, I just start saying things I'm grateful for. And the power of expressing gratitude is personally, I think, unlike any other superpower that we have in our tool belt, because gratitude actually changes you. So... After you take the picture and post the picture, you're going to report to HQ where you're going to get your patch, your sticker, your trading card, and your power-up card, all of which I have right here, but my special magic video makes some of the colors just disappear. So there's a picture of them right there. Now, the mission is free until November 30th. After November 30th, you can participate in this mission anytime you want. But if you're wanting to collect the patch and the power card and the sticker, we need you to submit it by the end of November and you'll get a claim code to claim this in our shop. Okay? So what's, oh, I wanted to show you what's all in it. So you'll get the patch and the power up card and our trading card, which I'm going to tell you more about our featured tiny superhero in a minute and a sticker, which you could even put in your journal if you want. I hope you're getting excited for next year because we have some really fun things in store for our mission that might be using your stickers. Okay, so I want to teach you a little bit about why this superpower really matters and why this mission really matters and that if it maybe seems challenging, that I promise you, you will see the benefits. So grown-ups, listen in. Regular gratitude journaling, and in everything I read, this is talking like five minutes a day. So this is not writing long pages of journaling. This is like what we're doing. Like pick one thing you're grateful for today and put it in a book, put it on paper, say it out loud. It has shown to result in five to 15% and it increases optimism, five to 15%. 
it increases your sleep quality 25%. Now, whether you're a tiny superhero or a grown-up, I have learned nothing else that will improve your sleep quality 25% in less than five minutes a day. So this is significant stuff and it's scientifically proven and it's why I think gratitude matters and why tiny superheroes, if we can practice it and learn it at a young age, you will just benefit for your whole life. So this is kind of what I was saying. Five minute daily gratitude journal, just like this, can increase your long-term well-being by 10%. So you can become 10% happier just by doing five minutes of this journal. It's really incredible. This is awesome. So you've, we've talked about random acts of kindness. We do our kindness mission. A one-time act of thoughtful gratitude produces an immediate 10% happiness and 35% reduces depressive symptoms. So when we're having a bad day, or when we're feeling kind of down, or when it's super cold and dark outside and it's the middle of the winter and I'm not feeling my best, by simply doing one act of gratitude, that will greatly change how I feel. How amazing is that? It's just really amazing. The last one I have for you is gratitude reduces negative emotions. So feelings like envy, frustration, Anger, regret, those are all normal feelings and it's totally healthy for us to have them. But when we practice gratitude, we have less of them. And I don't know about you, but I don't feel great inside when I'm feeling those things. When I'm feeling frustrated, I don't feel really good. When I'm feeling angry, I don't feel really good. So knowing that by practicing gratitude, I can feel that less, that is amazing. So not every superpower has this amazing data behind it to tell us why what we're doing matters. We know it does and we see the fruit of it in our squad every day. But gratitude is so simple and so important and together we can be accountable to it and it's going to be an amazing transformation not only of ourselves but of our families and the people around us. So grown-ups, I am inviting you to dig in deep on this mission and make your own journal or have a family journal. It doesn't matter, but make gratitude part of your family's daily conversation. I'm excited to introduce you to Super Daryl, who is our featured tiny superhero of this month and whose squad card you're gonna get when you complete this mission. We had, first of all, is he not the cutest? You guys, we had the pleasure and the privilege of Super Daryl visiting us at HQ. It was so recently, it filled our hearts up, and never, ever, ever have I ever seen somebody with such amazingly bright red hair. I mean, Daryl's hair radiates just as much as his personality. We had so much fun with Daryl, and we learned so much from him. So we know that you will also learn so much from Daryl. We cannot wait for you to learn more about him. But we are so grateful that he is on our squad leading us through our gratitude mission. And just know that you on the Tiny Superhero Squad are not alone. Daryl is here with you. There are tens of thousands of tiny superheroes who, just like you, are working to be their best selves. And we're changing the world together. And starting with a simple practice of gratitude can take us farther than many people will ever go. So let's lead them, okay? So a few reminders. If you are like me and maybe have trouble remembering to submit your missions in time, do not worry. You are not alone. We have the Mission Autopilot Program. It is $7 a month. And we will ship your mission kit to you at the beginning of the month. So then you can complete the mission whenever is good for you. And you don't ever have to worry about forgetting to submit a mission ever again. So you can sign up for that on our website. It will just renew $7 a month. You can add multiple children if you want. And it will just ship the mission kit to you right away at the beginning of the month. Secondly, don't forget. Look at, let's see. How do I match them? I can't, oh, there we go. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Don't forget, sidekicks, 
you are welcome here. Grown-ups, you are welcome here. You could print out 10 of these templates if you need to. This is for you. So sidekicks, dig in because all of the benefits of gratitude that I've talked about are available to all of us. And we would love for you to join us and we would love to send you a patch. You can adapt this mission in any way. Remember, whether you draw or write or print a picture or the grown-up draws or the grown-up writes or the grown-up picks a picture, uh, grown up prints a picture. This gratitude journal is more than the writing that you put in it. It's a practice and it's a memory and it's a keepsake and it is something that you can hold with you forever. Once we get into the habit of being gracious and saying out loud things we're grateful for, like you're driving home or you're in the back seat and you're kind of feeling gruffy and you see a beautiful tree with beautiful leaves, Simply saying, I am so grateful for those beautiful leaves is practicing gratitude. So this is for everyone. Adapt it however you want, okay? Most importantly, let's have fun. Let's do it, okay? So I'm excited. I am so grateful for you. Be beyond your whatever you could imagine, I am so grateful for you because squad, you have changed my whole life and because of you, I am someone who practices gratitude. And because of you, I am someone who wants to make the world around me better. And I am someone who knows that just the way I am, I'm valuable, just like just the way you are, you are valuable. And we love you and we can't wait to see your mission. So we hope you'll get started today. Bye, guys. You